We found out September last year that my partner Matt has type 1 diabetes. Type 1s normally get it when they're seven, eight years old, but um, at 28 he discovered that he was a bit sick and ended up in hospital and so it's Diabetes Over is a really good charity so I thought why not. Every year we do something really special to commemorate uh, the death of my daughter and the boy's sister and so tomorrow we're all going to run in memory of an amazing little girl, Whitney Faith. We love, love you, you Whitney! Whitney. Woo! Just over three and a half years ago I had what's known as a sleeve gastrectomy and as a result I have lost 50 kilos. So my reason for running is quite simply because I can. <laughs> I'm 86 years old and I'm doing the 14k course. Yeah, and what are you looking forward to tomorrow? Uh, I'll uh, look forward to um, beating a lot of people. <laughs> I'm feeling great. Why would you not be feeling great on a beautiful morning like this? Looking forward to running the, the second HBF run for a reason with thousands of like-minded people out here today. while we were running and there were so many happy, bright people out there. It's all about having a go and this was fantastic. was fantastic and heaps of people and yeah no really good entertainment all the way through and yeah brilliant. It was a bit bizarre having people recognise me out on the run and you'd kind of they'd be sort of in their own in their own space and then suddenly I'd run past and someone would yell and oh this you know this Steve Ronnie Giddy and they'd try and run along with me for a little bit which was which is I suppose that's one of the real benefits that they can actually get an empathy for how fast I'm running and I was probably running sort of three minute K so they'd run along for you know 20, 30, 50 metres and they're all in the medical tent now but apart from that I'm sure they had a great experience. Close to my heart is that I suffered from an eating disorder, so I found that for me to overcome my eating disorder and really start living was to start doing running, and it was something that I really want to encourage all people out there, especially people like me who remain silent for so long that you don't have to suffer in silence anymore, that you can still eat, you can still live, and you can still have fun and energy, and that's why I ran today. <laughs> we do it again, it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. Yeah.